Well, welcome everyone and congratulations for tuning in with us. Over the next few minutes, we are going to share some incredible stories for some real moms and we are gonna hear from them on how they are changing health for themselves and for their families. So I'd like to just kick us off. My name's Dawn Chow. I'm a certified health coach with Take Shape for Life and I'm also a registered nurse. I've been a nurse for about 13 years. And this is a little bit about my story. So six years ago, I was working full-time as a nurse and I had just gotten married and my husband and I were really wanting to look into having a family. And I had come to the realization that it wasn't the dryer shrinking my clothes. <laughs> I had actually gained about 45 pounds and had gotten to a point where I really wasn't happy and I was having some pain in my back and my knees and I wanted I really wanted to have a healthy pregnancy and I knew that to do that I needed to get my health under control. So I found an amazing program and through working with a health coach and that and the help of that program, I was able to lose 45 pounds and I had a fantastic healthy pregnancy. You can see me there with a little, little bundle um, on the left hand side. That's me um, just a month after my little one Natalie was born. And um, what I loved about the fact that I was able to lose weight prior to pregnancy, I had gained some really healthy habits. And I also knew that there was an amazing program for me once I had my little one for while I was nursing her to lose that baby weight. So you'll see in the bottom um, right, that's my little one and she's four now. And so I was able to lose 30 pounds on our nursing mom's plan over about three, four months. And then after she was done nursing, she's about 13 months old, I, I lost another 20 on what we call our five in one. So fantastic nutrition plans. But what I was really able to take from it was long-term health and a lot of habits that have sustained me now. So six years later from that upper left-hand corner, picture I'm now healthy and happy and my husband and I we we even lost weight together after having our little ones so we actually were able to um, change the course of our family like I had become kind of a statistic all the all the women in my family were overweight and many had diabetes and it's just amazing to know that with the help of a program like this I was able to change that so really excited for you to get to hear some stories tonight and what we're going to talk about is not just weight loss, but really the components of optimal health, which to me as a nurse meant so much because I wasn't interested in just losing weight only to have it find me again. I'd had that happen a few times in my life. And so we get to focus on a healthy body and a healthy mind and healthy finances. And so I would just love to ask you to take a minute, grab a piece of paper if you have one, but we're gonna focus on that healthy body part to begin with, and we're gonna to touch on each of these areas of optimal health over the next few minutes. But really, what does a healthy body mean to you? And where, where is your physical health right now? I know six years ago when I took a, a look at my physical health, it wasn't anywhere that I wanted it to be. And now when I take a look at the physical health I've been able to gain and then sustain, it's, it's awesome to be at a healthy weight, and to have energy to do the things I want with my family, with my little one, to be able to do all the physical activities that, that I want, um, and then to also just really um, focus just day in and day out on doing things that fuel my body and that are physically healthy for me. So really take a peek at where you would like to be with your physical health. And I'm really excited to introduce you to a friend of mine from down in San Diego. Her name's Christina. And she and I met actually in a nursing mom support group about three years ago. And so Christina, if you're with us, I would love for you just to come off mute and share a little bit about your story from the time we met three years ago to now. Absolutely. Thank you for having me, Dawn. So basically we met after I had had my second son. When I had my first son, I had put on some weight from him and I was not actually able to nurse him past a few weeks. So I did all these unhealthy things and um, a lot of yo-yo dieting to lose the weight. And so I kind of learned my lesson because none of that was enjoyable. I couldn't find anything that was good and healthy or anything positive from that experience. So after I had my second son and I was about 80 pounds higher than my pre-pregnancy weight, I was successfully nursing this beautiful little baby. And couldn't try the pills and supplements and not super healthy things that I had done after my first. And, you know, the, the thing was, 
after my first was that the weight always came back. So as soon as I stopped doing whatever it was I was doing, whatever crash diet nonsense I was trying, um, the weight came back and it came back pretty quickly. And so I knew that I didn't want to go through that again because I, I, it's not fun. It's not, it's not fun. So my requirements for a program were that it would teach me something I needed. I obviously didn't know really what I was doing. So I wanted to learn what I needed to know so that I could be healthy forever. I didn't want to have to do this again. If I was going to have a third baby potentially sometime in the future, I don't want to gain all that weight. My other requirement was really that it was healthy because I was feeding my baby with my body and I needed to make sure that I had good nutrition and that I wasn't putting anything unhealthy or detrimental to him in my body. And my other requirement was I still needed to be able to produce milk. Um, what I had learned in the first like six months of his life was that every time I tried to do it myself, cutting calories, working out, anything like that, my milk supply would plummet. And I was terrified. My goal was to make it to at least a year of nursing. And I wasn't going to sacrifice that for, you know, to lose a little bit of weight or a lot of weight. So I reached out and in, in my breastfeeding support group, cause I was hungry. I was hungry and I couldn't, I mean, not only was I not losing weight, but I was struggling not to gain weight because I was so hungry. And I'm telling you, those breastfeeding cravings were worse for me than when I was pregnant. It was just crazy. So I thought this is the place to go to find out what other, what has worked for other moms in my position. And that's where Dawn and I kind of connected on this. And she said, you know, I think I have something that will help you. And so I started, I mean, it took me a little bit I was scared. I was really scared that it, it was going to destroy my milk supply. And the amazing thing was that it didn't. So I started right before my little guy turned a year. I was still fully nursing him. I lost about 50 pounds in six months doing our nursing moms program. And the best part was I wasn't hungry. If I was hungry, I ate. If I felt uncomfortable with something or I felt like maybe my milk supply might be dipping, I could add in some snacks, but the amazing thing was that it didn't affect it. I nursed him. Everything was amazing. And, um, so that took me about six months and I'm down 50 pounds and now I'm kind of in a different spot in my life. And my husband is in the military and he was away. And so we were, I was coordinating a move from New Jersey to San Diego and it just kind of was that time in my life where I was happy to maintain. So I maintained my 50 pound weight loss for another six ish months while I handled being alone with two boys full time. Um, and then moving to San Diego. And once I got to San Diego, I was kind of ready to get thinking about getting started again, but I wasn't really nursing full time. He was only nursing a couple of times a day and I had some medical stuff pop up. I was diagnosed with lupus in the process of the move to San Diego and I had some really bad inflammation and all of those factors kind of led Dawn to guide me to our five in one program, which puts you into a fat burning state and could potentially lower your inflammation. So I figured I was kind of in need of something. And he, at this point he was to, uh, over two. And I thought, okay, well, you know, I've nursed him for two years. If this is, if it, maybe it's time. And so I did it. I actually was, I lost 30 pounds in eight weeks. I nursed him the whole time on five and one. Um, he was only nursing maybe twice a day. I ended up nursing him until he was almost three years old. I lost 80 pounds in the process and I lowered my inflammation and just felt incredible. And so at the end of this, I lost 80 pounds. I've maintained for a year and I have the energy to keep up with my kids and I have the tools that I need to be healthy forever for the rest of my life. And it has just been, this program was a godsend for me. What I loved most about it was wherever I was in my life, it had a plan to meet my needs. It was able to meet me in the season I was in. And, um, it's just been amazing. 
That's incredible. Christina, thank you so much for sharing. I remember that first time we talked and just having been part of your journey over the last three years to our conversations now where you're spending like two hours at the bouncy houses, jumping around out there, playing with your boys. I mean, you're not sitting on the bench on the sidelines of the playground anymore. You are playing, you are, you know, living all out full in and you are getting to share this with a lot of moms in your community, which is amazing. So thank you so much for sharing and um, really excited even for what the future holds because your health is just going even in a better direction all the time. So thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. You know, and what Christina was able to share a lot was, you know, the elements of a healthy body are not just healthy weight, although that's where a lot of times we begin because it's where our mind goes, but really it's learning those habits that are going to last forever, going to last a lifetime. And so healthy eating is important, fueling our bodies frequently, having breakfast, things like that, healthy motion, being able to really just participate in our lives. Sleep is a big deal, especially for moms. I don't know anyone, but um, anyone else who might have some issues sleeping in that first year or two after you have a baby. Yeah, sleep is something that's really important to focus on. And then also probably one of my favorites is healthy stress reduction. And so all of these are just elements of a healthy body that you get to work with with your health coach as you're finding the plan that works best for you and this is one of my favorite slides this really shows the path along um, health the journey of health it's the foundation so really it starts with beginning and preparing for your journey and then reaching a healthy weight and that's just step two. So most programs or most diets out there would stop at reaching healthy weight, but we don't. That's where we pick up. That's where we come right alongside you and we learn what's going to best fit into your life with your activity level and what you like to do. And then we learn how to eat healthy so that you can sustain those things and then learn those habits that are going to really lead you to living a longer, healthier life for yourself and with your family. And we have many different nutrition plans. Christina and I both mentioned the five in one plan. Really, that is one of that's our premier weight loss plan. And you know, once your baby is at a point where they're they're having less than 30% breast milk, you can look at this. You can talk to your health coach and decide whether this is the right plan for you to transition into. Like Christina and I visited when she had moved to San Diego, she was at a point where she was ready to actually get into a five in one plan that was going to meet her needs. And then now really we're all living these optimal health plans. So the optimal health three and three is this wonderful structure for really being healthy long-term. And I know a lot of, a lot of you on the line are really excited to learn a little bit more about our nursing mom's plan. And it's fantastic. What I love and what Christina touched on is that really it's a plan for you at whatever season you're at. So whatever stage you're at, but really when your baby's between two months and then to the end of nursing or when they're taking in less than 30% breast milk, we're going to find the plan that fits your needs and your baby's needs so that you can gently lose weight. So again, if your baby's two months old or older, and you're ready to have a nutritionally balanced plan where you can gently lose one to two pounds a week while you're still providing your little one with wonderful nutrition, um, this is probably a plan you're going to want to look at. And like I mentioned, there's plans that fit your needs. So there's a 1500 calorie plan and there's also an 1800 calorie plan. So that is just tailored to weight loss. We don't want you to lose more than two pounds a week. A week and we want it to be really gentle, but it's really about getting the right things in at the right time. So you're going to talk with the person who invited you to the call. You're going to connect with your health coach and really figure out where um, you're at and the age of your baby and where your milk supply is at and find the plan that fits. It's not about being perfect. It's really about getting enough of the right things in so that you can have wonderful milk production. Your baby's going to grow. You're going to feel good and you're going to be starting to, um, really implement some healthy habits back into your life. So consistency is key. And I just wanted to show just a couple things because these are just some ways that you can help track what you're eating. So whether you're a paper and, paper and pencil person or more of like a technology girl, um, you can track what you're eating and have it be really simple. I'm excited to invite the next person on to speak. Uh, Ashley, if you're there, I would love for you to unmute and just share a little bit about your journey and what it's been for you as little Witten is just now about 14 months old. He is. Yeah. Well, welcome. I just really, you know, you've had such a wonderful transformation over the last 12 months 
or so, 14 months since Whitten was born. Tell us a little bit about like what it was like for you um, kind of coming into this because you help a lot of women. You've helped a lot of women with this program even before you got pregnant with Whitten. So how's it been for you getting to experience it firsthand? Yeah, it's been amazing. Um, and thank you for having me on the call. I, um, yes, before having my son, I had been a health coach for about, oh, over five years at that point. So in that five years, I've coached lots of different friends um, and acquaintances through the Nursing Moms Plan, and I knew how effective it was. And so um, I was really excited for my uh, chance to get to experience too and see the transformation um, for myself. So um, I had a lot of faith in the structure of the plan. Um, and so I knew that this was going to be very gentle, very nutritionally sound. And those are all really important things to me. Like Christina, my priority was first and foremost, milk supply and the quality of that milk and the longevity of it. Um, my goal is to nurse to two years. Um, if Witten wants to keep nursing that long, which at this point, I think that's not going to be a problem, but um, yeah, that kid. So anyways, we, uh, that was the goal. And so um, I knew that I needed to have something that was going to support that first and foremost. And then my second focus is having enough energy. Um, I am pretty sensitive to, um, you know, food providing energy or not. And so being really in tune with that from my past, um, I have a really extreme fitness background and I knew how much fuel my body needed. So I knew, you know, this is going to have to stand up to that. Um, and that was never a problem. Plenty of energy. Um, he still doesn't sleep through the night. He's just not a sleeper, just like his dad, like they just don't sleep. And so, so in, with all that being said, I still was able to lose the weight, um, still able to have the energy following the program. And then um, number three for me has been um, to really be able to preserve my body postpartum. I plan on having lots and lots of babies and I needed a way to be able to be really gentle on my body. So hitting the gym really hard right away, like in my old pre-baby body life, was not going to provide my body what it needed for, um, you know, that longevity, um, to have really healthy pregnancies and really great labors and birthing experiences. So I knew I couldn't just like go crazy. Um, and I really needed to have the nutrition side dialed in so that when I was doing the exercises, they could be gentle and they could be strengthening my body in a, um, you know, more gentle way. So anyways, with all that being said, uh, this program was perfect. It proved itself out. I actually lost another pound. So I'm now negative 62 pounds. <laughs> so we can add that on there. Um, and that's at this point, it's just natural for me. I still, you know, track on my spreadsheets, but it's just become second nature. And this is literally with having such an extreme background, my nutrition was really extreme too. And it just wasn't sustainable for everyday real life. Like I could do it for 13 weeks for a competition, but to translate that to real life wasn't going to happen. And so this has totally been perfect for that. It's the perfect amount of um, calories and macronutrients for my body. And I I couldn't love it more. And so I'm just, I'm so passionate about it. I'm a huge advocate and, um, yeah, everyone I know who's done this program, their experience is amazing. So I really love it. That's incredible, Ashley. Thank you. You know what, what I heard you say was it translates into real life, which I, mm -hmm. I can't even imagine how many mamas out there are like, yes, please, something that's doable that translates into real life, please. And real life as a mama is busy and, you know, having perfect nutrition that you can throw in your diaper bag and have in your car and you know, in your glove box, wherever you're at, you can always, you're never more than like just an arm's length away from something that's going to be 
the great you know, you know, nutrition for your body. So that's awesome. And, and actually I remember you were sharing with me not that long ago that your um, doctor, your naturopath even was like blown away by some of the things that you were able to share with her not that long ago when you went in. Um, and I can't remember, can you remind me what that was that she shared? It was, I think about some of your lab work. It was. So, um, yeah, I went in, I, it was about five, six months postpartum. I went in just for, you know, a full blood panel. I needed a baseline. A lot of things happen to your body when you are pregnant. And so I needed to see like, what are we, um, what are we working with here? And so my blood work came back and she freaked out. First of all, I mean, naturopaths tend to be very, um, they're very holistic and they're very much about whole foods and full nutrition, and all these things. And that's why I go to her. Um, but I knew her, uh, she's a tough critic. And so for her to basically freak out about how good the blood work came back. Um, and I asked her, I'm like, what, why, like, why are these numbers so strong? It was not just um, you know, basic like vitamins were so high, but the hormones were so good. And she said, that's really, really, really hard to find. Um, she really couldn't believe how, how great the hormones came back, um, in the blood work. And she said, 100%, it has to do with your nutrition. She's like, whatever you're doing, keep doing it. This is incredible. And, um, then the next question was, can I put your business cards in my office? <laughs> so, <laughs> So, um, you know, something that she being so passionate, she doesn't have the time or even the ability to coach people on the program they need to be doing. So she is like now this huge advocate for what we do. Um, she couldn't believe it. It, yeah. So anyways, yeah. That's incredible. How neat to be able to inspire your doctor, your naturopath, and to just literally show what's possible with great nutrition. Thank you so much, Ashley. Thanks Super for having inspiring me. story. Super inspiring. Well, and probably too, she is blown away by the community that we offer and the education pieces of it. Because, you know, when you, we really have such a holistic program, we've got, you'll see up here in the upper, upper left-hand corner, those are Dr. Anderson's Habits of Health um, books. And they are really the education piece to our program. So it pairs education, tailoring it to your needs and to your daily life, like Ashley said, really translating it into real life. And then you have a health coach, someone who walks right by your side, someone who's right there with you, um, never more than a phone call or a text message away. And then this awesome community that we have online and even in person, like just really great support. You put all those things together. And I love, we've got Christina's picture in here again, you get great results. And so that's really one of the keys to the program is that you put it all together and really have an amazing program with a unique approach because we want to equip people with the tools to live a healthy, happy life for themselves and for their families long term. So some of the things that come with the Optimal Health Program and the entire system, if someone's on the line and you're just ready to get started and just curious, like what, what actually does come um, if I decide, yes, I'm ready and I want to take that step forward in my health, uh, 30 days of meals. And actually with a nursing mom's plan, it's, it's more than 30 days of meals. You have a personal health coach, someone who cares about your goals and is right there with you. All the program materials you just saw in the slide before, and then social media uh, communities of support. And then of course, my favorite is also something that was my husband's favorite right? Was that it's cost neutral and it saved me um, actually a ton because I was being more mindful of the nutrients I was putting in my body. And he was really happy to see me putting myself first and actually, you know, taking the time to care about what I was eating. And uh, it actually gave me a lot more time back in my day. And he loved that at the end of the month, it had saved us quite a bit. Um, so really, if you're sitting there and you're listening to this and something's resonating with you, just, you know, ask yourself, can I eat every three hours? <laughs> I didn't have a problem doing that. Clearly, I gained 45 pounds. No problem eating every three hours. Uh, can you drink water? Water is so important. Do I value support? And would I love to have someone who has the experience of helping others right there beside me helping me? And then really the most important one is, am I ready? So think about that for a little bit as we bring on our next speaker, a friend of mine from nursing school, Colleen. Colleen, are you there with us tonight? Can you unmute and share a little bit about your story? Uh, yes. 
Thank you. Um, my name's Colleen and I'm a certified health coach as well as a certified nurse midwife. Um, Don and I had met uh, back in nursing school and um, I was watching over her Facebook feed and she kept on posting all of these amazing before and after pictures and I was like, what is, what is she into? It's too good to be true. Um, but I was about to start a very hectic um, phase in my life. I found out I um, got into graduate school to become a nurse midwife. At that time, I was working as a labor and delivery nurse. And I found out I was or had planned to travel back and forth from Seattle to California um, to accomplish this graduate school. So I called Dawn to um, see what this program was about because I was at a phase where I wanted to lose weight at that time and was fearful that if I didn't do something about it then that I continue to get ahead of my, the weight would get ahead of me um, by the end of three years of graduate school. So that's my before and after picture on the very bottom. Um, I was very happy in my before picture, but I was definitely heavier than I wanted to be. I was fit. This was during our um, three-day backpacking trip in Yosemite. I um, enjoyed where we were, but I, I wanted to lose weight. And so the I did the five-in-one program after talking to Dawn instantly and I had great success I lost 50 pounds over three months and the thing that really resonated with me during that time was um, the nutrition guidance I think I texted Dawn and said why isn't this our nursing school textbook like this is brilliant now I actually understand nutrition and I feel like I can be a better nurse and a better healthcare provider in this way um, and what was more fabulous is that since I was on the go, I needed to not think about food. I needed to just have an answer and be able to grab what um, was nutritious for me so that I could have the energy to be able to um, do all that I was demanding on myself. Um, so I was able to keep it off um, throughout the entire graduate school. I gained maybe 10 pounds at the very end when I was um, losing some of my healthy habits because of what school um, had put on me, whether it was being up 48 hours continuously, help supporting a birth, which was awesome. But then um, I knew I had this program to rely on. So I wasn't fearful of this phase in life that kind of plateaued and valleyed for me. So that bottom right hand corner um, is a picture of me graduating uh, with my husband. This was a really special time because we're happy to be done with that phase. And then I had just found out two weeks before that we were pregnant with my sweet little baby boy who's up in that left corner, Joaquin. Um, but I had originally thought I was gonna start that five in one and get that little few pounds off. Um, so I knew that wasn't the plan now. And I ended up having a wonderful pregnancy. I gained more than even I probably would recommend someone gaining, but I was healthy. <laughs> um, and I wasn't fearful that I couldn't lose this weight again because I knew that we had a nursing plan to offer people. And I was actually really looking forward to trying it for myself as a healthcare provider um, so that I knew how to experience it and offer it to um, any patients or clients of myself as well as so many friends and family that have babies as well. Um, so by the time I um, had Joaquin, I was just starting my nurse midwifery practice, and again, in a very hectic lifestyle. Um, I was sleep deprived, emotional, and um, needed help and guidance. So I definitely called up Dawn, and um, she helped me get onto that nursing program. And it took me a little bit to get in my groove, but once I finally figured it out, I wish I had figured it out before, but it, it, it my stress decreased for how much I was juggling. My sleep improved, even though my baby was not sleeping through the night, I actually felt rested. And um, my energy was amazing. I would actually walk past a lot of coworkers and friends and be like, wow, you, you look like yourself. Is Joaquin sleeping through the night? And I'm like, no, he's definitely not sleeping through the night, but I actually finally feel like myself. And um, that's after starting the Nursing Moms program. So I've lost overall 32 pounds and have about 10 more pounds to get to my pre-pregnancy weight. Um, and, and then I hope to even go on my five and one and get back to where I originally was in order to now know I can plan for my next healthy pregnancy. So just lastly, what, um, feels the best is that I know this program is so exciting that 
I can offer it through women preconceptually because it's such a good program to be able to get on if you're planning pregnancy and to be able to get to your healthy weight. And it's such a good program even to know you have during pregnancy if you need to balance your nutrition and your blood sugar. Um, and then, of course, everything we've been saying about the nursing program, um, be able to get healthy for yourself and to keep your nursing so, or your milk supply up. So it's been a wonderful experience and I couldn't say anything more better about it for myself and for others. Thank you so much, Colleen. Wow. I, you know, and just, it's been really an honor being part of your journey and I've been cheering you on as you were in graduate school and getting your doctorate and, and now that you get to be a part of other women's journeys and, and their health and pre-baby and during, during pregnancy and now post and that we get to experience it together. And so we can kind of speak from that experience, but also um, congratulations on being able to navigate all of that with such a busy schedule and that you had our program right there by your side. So thank you. It's yes. been, been wonderful. And the wonderful thing was, is that that fear of weight going, coming on or off, you know, you, we know you have this program and the support. So it makes it no it does. It, and you know, that support is, is so awesome. And you know, you and I were talking not that long ago, just kind of about the state of health and as being healthcare providers and just having been a part of, you know, the system that is really kind of actually sick care. Now I worked in acute care, you know, with adult patients, but it's just, it's amazing how I was becoming part of that statistic. I was becoming uh, one of the overweight adults, <laughs> part of the population. And I think, um, scary when you see that and it feels so good to be a part of actually changing those statistics and not only for ourselves and our families, but we get to pay this forward to our children and um, our husbands get to come along with us and get healthy and our whole family get to get healthy. So um, just a couple, you know, statistics out there, like more than a third of adults in America are overweight and one in six children. And so Colleen, I'm just really excited that you are able to follow this program and then also offer it to the women and to the families around you. So thank you. Um, this is just a little bit of the rippling out of health that can happen because really as moms, we can be the gatekeepers of health in our families. And so when we get our health um, back into alignment and back into balance, it ripples into our families, into our children, our husbands, our moms, our parents, um, and then out into the world beyond us, into, into our communities and into the larger families. So for me, it was neat because we get to start making those healthy choices and we get to be a part of creating a healthier community just by living by example, it's neat to have people notice and to then be inspired themselves, whether it's to drink more water or to be more active. Um, they actually, you know, we can inspire others around us. And then that ripple effect is pretty amazing, which is why I feel blessed every day to be a health coach and to be working alongside amazing women like you guys, because it reinforced my decision to be healthy. Absolutely. I spent too many years going up and down. Down, like you said, those peaks and valleys, Colleen, of um, afraid that weight was going to come back on. And now I'm not afraid anymore. And I'm hearing that in what Christina said and Ashley and, and you too, Colleen, that we really have um, healthy foundation now that weight's not going to come back on. And we're building a community all around us of healthy, like-minded people. And it's been great for me to be able to pursue the passion of helping people and also the desire to be home with my family and to be with my, my um, little girl and soon to hopefully be a larger family growing, you know, it's just, just neat to focus on that and to be a part of something big that's actually changing the lives of other people around us. So it really feels good to be part of the solution. I just want to finish up today just by talking about the last two pieces of this, uh, com the components of a healthy body and really optimal health. And my favorite, again, was the healthy mind piece. It has been really rewarding to be able to um, really have that healthy mind come into balance along with as we're creating these healthy bodies. Uh, the six inches of real estate between our ears is the most valuable six inches of real estate on the entire planet. And I love that we have a program that helps support us in not only getting our physical health back, but also our mental health. And so just take a minute and think about where your mental health is and the things that you'd like to see improved. And then also healthy finances. I didn't fully understand when I started this program six years ago to lose weight, how much um, living with an abundant mindset can affect your overall health and your stress level and things like that. But being part of this community, getting my health back in all of these areas, and then having the ability to share it with others has 
affected this part of my life and my family's life and, and the people that I work with um, in sharing this with others beyond what I could have even imagined. So also think a little bit about your health in the sense of abundance and where you're at there and what you'd like to see happen. And really, as I just close, really, what does a balanced life mean to you? I know for me, a balanced life meant that I was the best version of myself, the healthiest version of myself for my family. And then what I realized is that I deserved a healthy version of myself for me and that it was beyond exciting to then be able to share what I have found with others. So this, a balanced life can mean anything from being able to spend more time with your family to more time with your friends to really centering your life around what matters most to you. And what I love is that each of us have a different definition of what that means. Um, but we just invite you to kind of think about that tonight. And as, as we're kind of closing, I just want to thank all of the awesome mamas who were on this call and who shared from the heart and shared your stories real, <laughs> still not getting a lot of sleep out there. Some of us, but you know, we actually have a program that translates into real life. And so I hope you enjoyed the stories and I hope that maybe something that someone shared uh, resonated with you. And if it did, please connect with a person that cared enough to send you this link. We would be honored to support you on your journey to health. And we really would love to be part of your healthy family. So I hope that you enjoyed this call and please just reach out. We'd be honored to walk alongside you on your health journey. Have a good night.